Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to another episode of House of the Dragon, episode 9. Last time, uh, another time skip, sits your time skip. Um, the children have, well, not grown up, but they've been growing. We gotta look at all of them. Um, Renera's children look pretty normal, honestly. Um, I kind of like the older one a bit. He seems uh, responsible and very dutiful so far. Uh, Allison's children, well, Adon seems like a dick, but more. Now a rapist dick. <laughs> um, I felt, I mean, it was the path he was trying to go down. We saw it in early stages. Um, Amon turned into like a beast, which is good, because again, they're, they're on Team Hightower. So I, I'd rather have him than be against him. And the daughters still weird so <laughs> um but yeah um it was actually a pretty sweet episode with the uh, really love the dinner scene with the king pretty sure he's dead now it'd be really funny if he was still alive but it seemed like a perfect ending for him to die seeing everyone uh happy and stuff um even though it's definitely not gonna stay that way um even Renera and Allison seemed to bond over it but I'm sure like I don't know if this will be right away. I'd like it to be right away so we can get a nice funeral for Viserys, because he was one of my favorite characters, and the actor that played him was phenomenal. Um, but if it is a time skip, I assume there's going to be tense again, because no matter, like, even if they wanted to push away all the drama, it just the just their positions, it's impossible to, even if they wanted to. So it's just a, a losing battle, I guess, in a medieval, like, fantasy world. It's just bound to happen. But yeah, still still Team Hightower. I think we're still looking pretty good. Um, at least, you know, comparing the children. Because, uh, cause, again, Aemond. I feel like he can hard carry. I don't know if like how much of a leader he is, but... Um, but yeah. Sorry, just checking. We're Gucci... Um, all right, yeah, Let, let's get the episode started. Uh, my copy of the episode is 57 minutes, 51 seconds. If yours is different, you have to adjust that, and at the end of the episode and during the credits, we'll do a mini episode review. It should be fun. But yeah, let's get into it in three, two, one, go. Oh yeah, and uh, the sea snake stuff happened. I wonder if uh, the sea snake will come back alive. His brother is now dead. I don't know if that'll have any consequences. But, yeah, we'll see. He was kind of being treacherous a bit, even to the sea snake. So, I don't know how much uh, they would mind. I'm more worried about if people would accept uh, Luke as the heir. Like, just the people in general would accept it. I feel like he's more vulnerable there than in King's Landing, just because... I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I, I wouldn't be surprised if things go to shit this episode, because, again, it's fitting that uh, it would after Viserys died, who is constantly trying to keep it together, but without him looking over things and kind of keeping people together. I feel like a, a storm is brewing. <laughs> oh, and I didn't realize last episode, I missed it, but the the Dornish looking lady at the end that was, that had a spy, one of the maids was a spy, is actually Damon's old girlfriend. I totally missed that. I thought it was just a lady, so. Yeah, we haven't seen her in like so long. Plus, you know, I took a break from the series, so. I just didn't recognize her, but wonder what she's plotting. <laughs> He's dead, bro. This is the King Viserys is dead. The throne is empty. Kind of shot. So great. <laughs>
Bam. Ooh. Renarius. Renarius kids. I assume. Either Viserys or the other Adon. So there's two Adons, which is kind of confusing. <laughs> So this is a time skip. Bro, if the king lived through a time skip and he just died now, that would be insane. I don't think so, though. Joint? Is that a joint something? Oh, that's Alicent. Is it? No, it's not. Okay, I was, like, so confused. That's a maid. She looked hella old. Okay, Viserys just died? So, he lived longer than that night? He lived longer than that night? My dude was trucking. Had to be at least a year or two, because those were tiny kids. But kids grow fast. Well, peace time is over. Gotta secure the throne. Hopefully Rhaenyra doesn't kill the, her chi children. She's a spy. <laughs> Wait, so that wasn't... That couldn't have been... Uh... Okay, so it's not a time skip, because that's not Rhaenyra's kid. It makes no sense. Never mind. He's he's just blonde. <laughs> and there, yeah. <laughs> My bad. What? Oh, no. Her d the miscommunication. Okay, so this is right after, maybe. Maybe this is right after? Uh, uh, honestly, the ending of last episode was a little silly. The miscommunication thing. I feel like she'd be, like, used to it. Because he's been, like, milk of the poppy talking all the time. Good one, bro. Good one, Jason. My boy. I like Jason still. I like the Lannisters, man. I'm t I was Team Lannister. Well, before Stan. After Stannis died. The Peaceful. That's a nice title. Oh, the Fake Will. No, they're using that? That's crazy. That's crazy. You can't really use that, though. Seems way too messy. And he was on Milk of the Poppy. Otto's taking it, though? Smart. So he's been scheming with Jason based. Jason on Team High Towers based. Well, you need the planning. Burbsby. Beersby? This guy's based, even though he's not on our team. True? True? Well, not true, but... Longer than Otto. But 
Don't kill Beersberry. He's he's just an old guy. He's just an old guy. Barely. Shut up. That's... That's... Okay, that's too much. That's... That's too much. You just killed Beersbury. Good one, Tristan. <laughs> no! Hey! He's fine. Otto, save him. I bet Tristan can beat his ass. Base Tristan, actually. Why are they even here? I guess they need to be here. He's not on he's not a really high tower team though. So I'm a little nervous. This guy is not really high tower either. Though maybe a bit. <laughs> like how Jason just got out of the way of the beef. Poor Beesbury. I liked him, but he wasn't on our team. Well, the ha, yeah, this is this is not gonna go well. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Yo, he is on our team based. He definitely doesn't. Hey, no bully. We need don't, no Discord, Allison. I get you're feeling bad, but this is the time to strike, even though it's pretty slimy. Yeah, what would you do with this information that you think you have? <laughs> I wonder what the Kings Guard can do, because they. S Serve the tin, but yeah, we're just marching there. Oh, he's quitting. Okay, he didn't really seem Team High Tower. Well, you're probably not getting your place back. Unless Renera rules. Kristen, you want an upgrade? <laughs> oh my god. Is that her and Adon's children? The spider. Well, he's probably just banging someone. So they had... Well, I can't even... They look like girls, but... I know they grow their hair at long. The men of the Targaryen, at least. We're going to war! And he's done become king, I guess. Yeah, he's becoming king. That's, that's a big deal. 
Ta <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Hello, Amond. We're doing a war again. I'm glad to have him. He's still young, though. Well, I don't know. It's kind of a weird situation. The keep? Okay. I thought he like left King's Landing. That'd be crazy. He has a brother? Huh. I guess... This auto needs to take charge here. This is a very delicate time. He is kind of like a mini Tywin Lannister, huh? Not say, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> oh, locked in. Based. Clearing everyone out. So if she's here, then yes, this is literally the day after. Wait, is it? Well, if they're in Dragonstone, then no. Hello? Him in the war might be dead too, huh? Something bids happening. Kristen! Yep. Oh. Okay, they're both fighting for his loyalty. Because a war won't break out, maybe. That's, that's fair. It's his brother. And they're, they're like a power duo. They're not gonna get hurt. These two are actually Giga Chads in combat. I'm not worried. So Otto obviously would like kind of manipulate him. Kind of like, yeah, make him think that he deserves the throne and stuff like that. Well, Allison would be more gentle. I don't like this division between Hightower and... But Whorehouse? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, there's... Oh, they're twins. I feel like I patch a Amon is super obvious. <laughs> Years. I don't know what that means. Lit. 
less discriminating instead of a whorehouse. Or, I don't know what said. Maybe it's not a whorehouse. It's so sketchy, though. Some of them are. Huh. Base. Lock it down. Oh, this is the guy that was like, thank God you're here too, Rhaenyra. Who's this guy? What family are you in? What? Know you who you're talking to, buddy? You know bald man won't. I think. Who are you? Fell. House fell. Oh, okay, smart. <laughs> what do you think about this? Because he's just more Team Alicent. So, like, he's hard Team Alicent. Dude, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Bro, there's <laughs> Identica. Who is that? Well, then he'd be king, I guess. Well, I don't know if it would pass back to an era. This is more of like a special exception. Oh, you know... Oh, <laughs> some street fights, eh? Children fights. It's like dog fighting for both kids. Jesus. You know, Amon and... Cole's gonna end up having to fight these two, I think. 2v2. So they know he's a monster. So they might want to kill him. If he becomes a king. Instead of making him a king. Oh, bastards. What? I mean, made sense, but... Hi, Tyler, you can't trust this guy, dude. He's a Rhaenyra simp. He's a loyal man. Kill him. True. All true, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Better than Renera having it though, right? True, true. Cool. I really like Amond. Bro, kill this guy. Kill this guy. True. 
True. Who's this? Just a girl? Bro, the tra- Spy lady? Yeah, it is Damon's ex-boyfriend. Oh, well, these guys are my, I don't, they're, uh, shoot him. Oh, no, he's down to find their bodies hanging. Maybe, oh, no, they got him. Based. But, yep, smart. Thank you, thank you, Wasp Man. True. They just be Team Hightower. We're unifying. Kind of. It's just a rift right now. It'll, it'll be fits eventually. Oh. Rip, my dude. The series, the peaceful. Oh, it hurts the heart, man. Her morning dress looks a badass, though. Actually, that's just her normal dress. I thought it was morning. It looks, it looks black in this shot, right? It's just the lighting. Still, it's good, though. Why is she even still here, by the way? She's been here for so long. Is she, has she been here for, like, the whole time? Oh, I guess, like, Rhaenyra left early. Yeah, so she's still here, but Rhaenyra left early. Okay. I get it. True, based on true. Nah, she wouldn't. Nothing. <laughs> okay. Cut cold it. <laughs> We don't know. True.
true. Technically, she was older. And like the direct heir, right? The Alice and Gambit is actually popping off. True. True. Uh, don't don't put these ideas in her head. You're dividing us. I don't like to. I like Tristan's hat. <laughs> I mentioned it before. It looks so silly. Ooh. Okay, at least we caught the conversation. Ooh. That proves it. What? I mean, based, but okay, actually based. <laughs> sure. I mean, you don't really want her to be an enemy, so. I mean, true, but also, like, they have an army that can probably just kill everyone. <laughs> they Obviously, it's a bad play, but I know what she's saying. You gotta be careful, though. Otto is no man to back down. Yeah, and Damon and Cole are f following them, so if they do try something funny with uh, Aegon, they can stop it. I know that. Cough anywhere. Oh, he put him in with that. <laughs> oh. What?
true. Well, at least they're bringing them to auto. Touch swords. Face. Bet you don't know fight. Where are you going? Yo, popping off. Ko's literally like the best fighter we've seen on the show so far, so it's impressive if he wins. I don't know if he's deteriorated from being salty the whole time. What the fuck? Yo, that was a sit disarm. That was a sit disarm. <laughs> he doesn't even want it, dude. Oh, well, maybe he'll grow to like it eventually. He's probably not going to be a good king, though. Don't think he'll be too peaceful. <laughs> Alright, well, at least Allison got him. It's a little better. <laughs> and Otto had to pay the money too. <laughs> Unlucky. True. True. Actually. What? What? What the fuck? True. True. No, she not. <sighs> She's in her head, man. Well, Renera's going to come attacking either way when she learns the news. I actually think it's a better play to, like, sneak attack them, but I'd let her opinion. This... Yes, yes. But the thing is, she doesn't have too much allies, right? A lot of people would rather have Aegon, I think. Wow, that's rough. Base, true. I love that. Okay. It's not enough. Oh. I feel like it's too naive. Way too naive. Just leave it to Otto. Happy for my boy Toldo. He's climbing. Climbing the la I mean, he's reached the top. He's 
reached the top of the ladder, honestly. Who this? Who's coming? Yeah, I knew someone was gonna be here. Honestly, he would be the perfect guy to kill that assassin. Oh, new tech. Laris. White worm. Oh, he told him. Kinda. Is that what he's standing at? Or the white worm thing? Oh, the white worm. He didn't tell him. Flat scene? Huh. What if you cut it down? He can cut her down, I think. Is is this payment for him? Is this is this payment? He's a feet guy. <laughs> oh my god! My guy, I respect it. I'm not a feet guy myself, but. My dude's bargaining with feet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bruh. What would it cost? My dad's... Oh my god, what, what more is she trying to show? You think he has a feet fetish because his, uh. Because he's crippled? This is. Honestly? He's kind of based. Imagine, like, trading in assassinations to masturbate to your feet, too. That's a great deal for Allison. Well, I trust him, B dies, so I think he's gonna do fine. <coughs> oh, that is. That's funny. I think it is because he's stunted. His foot's fucked up, so he likes perfect feet. And apparently, Allison has him. I mean, they did look like pretty good feet. I'm not really a feet connoisseur. We should Google the actress on uh, Feet Wiki. <laughs> which is a site where they rate celebrities' feet. I found that when I was in Mexico. It was funny. Who this? Who the fuck is that? Oh, wait, it's just him? Why? What? I thought she's gonna join the team. Who got hanged? Oh, based, honestly? Not really, but we gotta do it. It is what it is. Where's the other ones? This is a little dangerous, though. 
Is this the good guy or the ba the one that's loyal to Otto, though? What if this is just a tarp? Yeah, this is a trap. This feels like a trap, actually. If she's dead, they can just take her dragon. Oh! Is that where the spider lives? I don't think she. If you don't see her die, then I don't think she died. And the funny thing is, she might think Otto did it. And that might start some weird beef. Bro, this might be the Otto. Otto team start. Unless. But he seems cautious, so maybe he is good. The stampede! Why are we stampeding? To the fire? Oh no. <laughs> oh, the sheep! It's the sheep run! Oh, good job, Kinsguard. You really fucked this up. Uh. Oh, boy. Hello. Look at him. I like his old black drip. That it's kinda rough. Motivation! Take the motivation, Ada. It's so hard to cheer for him, but I do feel kind of bad for him at the same time. I feel like he's turned into this horrible person just because of how he was born. Circumstances. Cool stager sword. Legendary. This is for the. This is about the first Ada did, right? First Adon's weapon. <laughs> yeah. Of course she loves him. If he did, if she didn't love him, she probably. I don't know. Harsher punishment. <laughs> Bro. I hope Renice doesn't just die like a really bad death. Just getting trampled or something. Bruh. What are we looking at? The sun? Oh, they're gathering all the people to witness the new king. That made sense. That's just like sudden too. They probably normally know ahead of time.
There's so much people. Imagine they have a front seat to that. Oh my god. Ooh. <laughs> Yo, that <laughs> one guy looked really hype. I mean, yeah, they generally wanted this, right? More people wanted the sun than Rhaenyra's. So, I feel like the general support. <laughs> hey, be nice. But also, yeah, you gotta make way. Think you got some pep in it? Pep in his step now? I feel like you got buffed a bit. It is fancy. He does look kind of dripped out. You can't lie about that. In all black. And the little cut on his face too makes him look a little rougher. Does be looking good. Dude, imagine like you're one of the peasants just being so close to him. Must be so hype. Ooh. <laughs> the pageantry. They've never had a good relationship, though. Whenever you see Otto and him around, like, Otto's kind of harsh on him. Only that one time when he kicked him. He... Like, Adon's a wild guy. I do feel like he kind of respects his mother, though. If he respects anyone. And maybe his brother. Yo! It's kind of like Catholicism right here. Like, uh, what's it called? Communion? It's been a while. Speech, 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 speech. Do they usually give a speech? Ooh. Tristan gets to put it on his head? I guess he is the lead team star. So he is wanting to protect them. Oh god. I'm... Hey. Perfectly fit for the head. Okay, it wouldn't fit my head. I have a humongous head. Based. True? True? That guy's nodding. He knows? He does look good. Like, his design looks really cool. Speech! Speech! Speech. Oh, why is his wife so hesitant? Seeing his grandfather bow to him must feel really good.
Speech. <laughs> and he's also someone who like never gets praised in his life. Like he's always getting scolded and stuff. So it must feel really good. Uh, uh, kind of an underdog story. Maybe he'll shape up. Maybe he'll be a good king. Copium. <laughs> Get inspired. He has the people's support. That is important. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. He's into it. Okay. At least he's motivated now. Let's just hope he... Like... This leads him down a better path. T-pose? A little T-pose? It's Sir Dominance? You'll love to see it. Whoa! That looked very CG when the rods came closer. What? Oh, is this Rainies? <laughs> it's looking a little stuffed, but that's okay. Gotta keep it not so close, guys. That looks cool, though. Just the rocks that look weird. <laughs> this has to be rainy. We've never seen this dragon, right? All red. We have dragons, all right. Don't kill Allison! Don't you dare ruin our plans! Or is she bowing? She might bow. She might bow. Be based and bow. Be based and bow? Bow. No, she's bowing. Maybe. I think she's... She's here to serve. Or no, she's just leaving? Okay. What? I don't know what that means. She on our team? <laughs> Is that good or bad? Feel like it could be either or. Damn, dude, if she bowed there, I would have been so hyped. Okay, well... Didn't do exactly as planned, but it's not horrible. She was kind of asleep anyway. She just kind of, like, dabbed on them and left. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, that was a fun episode. It was, like, it was a really different episode. It was pretty intense, too. And then next episode, we're going to find out what the other side thinks of this. And it's just going to go to war, man. It just... It does make me a little, <laughs> like, I, I love this, but it makes me a little mad that this is happening because of what Allison told everyone, even though my dude was, like, high out of his mind. Like, he was high out of his mind, right? He, they took him away from the dinner, and then they gave him Mouth of the Poppy, or what is it? Mouth of the Poppy, is that what it's called? I forgot. Whatever, but he was, he was, like, he was, he was loopy. <laughs> Like, I don't know, man. Right? Sorry, let, let's finish the credits. Okay. Um. Yeah, that was a good episode. I thought... I, I actually really liked that. 
Also, just to reiterate, I, you know, when I thought that scene looking kind of weird, I didn't think, like, the dragon looked amazing. It's just when he came in and the rocks, like, go into your face, because obviously they're CGI because they're not blowing up the building. Um, <laughs> it just looked stuff. Like, and then the tail whip where people are falling looked really green screen or something. Like, um, yeah. <laughs> But uh, the show normally looks good, right? There's been hiccups here and there. I didn't mention it, but you know that the lighting in that one episode and this. But man, that was a good episode. Major dubs for Team Hightower. Um, I didn't really think it would go this route. I thought like stuff might get stuff because of what the team said. But Otto sees that chance and he's like, hey, yo, my, my, let, let's just jump on it. And you know, I respect Alicent. Sorry, multitasking. I respect Alicent and stuff, but it is totally right to kill Renera. Because, yes, they're friends, but no, Renera is not just gonna accept the death. Or accept the, these terms or whatever. She's going to war, so proactively killing her, maybe getting Mr. Wasp guy to kill her, um, would definitely be the better play, in my opinion. It feels like it's naive. I know they just had this moment, because I was saying, I'm assuming it's a couple days. Not a couple days, it's been a day at most. No, I think it's right after. I think it's literally right after um, the last episode. So obviously she's super emotional and stuff, but again, he's drugged out of his mind, and the fact that they can take this statement and roll with it, knowing that he's high on milk of the poppy, um, is really funny. <laughs> But, like, the thing is, and, like, there's only one witness, too. Obviously, this is a different world. And, you know, in our terms, it would be, like, a medieval world. So, but there's, like, no proof at all. <laughs> but, you know, proof doesn't matter. You know, look at Game of Thrones with a uh, season run with uh, just ripping up the teen's wishes when he died. So, I guess it's fine. Whatever. <laughs> like, yeah. Um... I also don't think the spy lady's dead. Here's here's the key. Um, in a show like this, and just a, a general rule of thumb, though it depends on the show, if they don't show the character actively dying, it probably means they're not dead. You know how they showed uh, Lionel's brother, Lionel's brother um, getting burnt alive, and they just... You know he's dead, because they showed his burnt corpse afterwards. They just showed a house on fire. I think, uh, I actually think our, our good friend missed, which is surprising, because he's usually, uh, pretty on top of it, but even the best can miss sometimes. Um, uh, so I think she's alive, and it might bite them in the ass, though I think it might bite Otto in the ass, because I don't think she would know that Wasp Guy did it, unless she's knowledgeable of Wasp Guy. A.K.A. Lionel. I just call him Wasp Guy, because I keep missing up his name. Also, that was that was a funny scene with Lionel, man. Trading information and assassinations for feet pits, basically. Like, medieval feet pits. I mean, to be fair, I feel like I guess jacking off to the queen's feet right in front of her. Like, it is pretty, like... You know, <laughs> I guess it, like, it would cost a lot. It's worth a lot, dude. But again, I do think they would reveal it. That, or maybe they won't reveal it. I think it's like, because he can't walk properly, he loves perfect feet. And I guess Allison does have the perfect feet. Yo, we said we would do it. Check her out on Feet Wiki. We'll, we'll see the feet connoisseurs, what they think of her. Feet, feet Wiki. So I found this, like, when I was, like, super drunk. Wiki feet, my bad. I was super drunk in Mexico, and we found this website with the boys. Oh, you're just looking people up. Dude, feet of the day, feet of the week. Happy birthday to these people. And then they just show their feet. Honestly, it's kind of based. Uh, okay. I, don't know. I don't have a feet foot fetish. I always found it a little weird just to, you know, it's like one of the dirty spots. But I don't eat your own. Also, I have really ugly feet, so that's probably not why. I mean, that's probably why. It's not really my thing. Okay, is it Olivia Cookie? Wait, there's two Alicents. It's Olivia Cookie. That one looks... That's the young one for sure. Yeah. Okay. 
What a name, Olivia Cookie. Okay, don't don't even like look at anything just in case of spoilers. Olivia Cookie on Wiki Feet. Let's see the rating. Rating five stars. Beautiful feet. She's an eighty. <laughs> uh, born in the UK. I can't. I can't take this properly. I feel like a perfect five star rating is pretty good. Honestly, you just got to be impressed with this website. I I don't think I've ever seen a website like a fetish website so like well made. Feet of the year dating platform for fellow feet enjoyers. Like there's a f comment section. Foot fucker. <laughs> This is the first film where I noticed her feet, but that scene in House of Dragon drove the point home. She's a foot queen. It's so good. Yo, this is like when before my anime list took off the comments, man. Reading people's comments. Oh my god, it was so funny. I gotta do this more, man. Gotta watch more live action stuff than end the episode with reading one of the people's wiki feet logs. By Mr. Dre, finally saw this scene, and wow, just wow, I will say no more on it. XD, Allison's feet are sexy as her perma frown. Okay, enough, enough feet stuff. I just, it, it's just funny. <laughs> also, Adon, big, big focus of this episode. I have high hopes for Adon. He's... Again, he's a horrible person. He he watches ch children fight. He sexually abuses people. I think it's despite being a prince, his upbringing was pretty, pretty um rough. I think um like his father. Oh, well, he thinks his father doesn't love him. I think Viserys loved him. It's just um I just think he never really. Since he was such a troubled child, he never really found any, like, compliments at all. So I think, like, the scene at the end, well, not the dragon scene, but the one before, I think just seeing people actually, you know, respect him, like, clap to him, bow to him, um, because I don't think he's ever done respect in his life, and, like, he even shook a little when Otto did it, because we know Otto was way more strict with him. I think that really, like little fire in him so i think he can actually like turn himself around as crazy as that sounds i'm hoping hopefully he doesn't just degrade into the terrible person he is um he's been but i don't know maybe we'll see a proper adon you know amond uh finally says that he wishes he could be king he's been putting in the work and stuff which is fair enough but it just isn't how it is <laughs> in this world um, Cole's been upgraded to commander of the Kingsguard, which is based. We, we love, we love that around here. Um, Adon's wife's a little apprehensive, but I, I don't know. She's, she's just a weirdo. That's about it. I don't know what Rhaenyra's is doing. I think she's not joining Hightower. If she is, though, we really need her. How many dragons do Hightower have? They have Adon's dragon, they have... Amon's dragon. All the children have dragons. So three dragons there. Alicent doesn't have a dragon. So just three. Um, And Rhaenyra's is a mystery. But how much does... uh? Wait, no, not Rhaenyra. I keep that. Raimi's is a mystery. Rhaenyra has her dragon. Damon has a dragon. All of their children have dragons. I don't know if Joffrey has or any of the two other kids, but... The first two have dragons, I think, so. I don't know. Dragon warfare. It's kind of spooky, because... Because um, it's such a strong force that, like, it can just decimate an army. You really have to, like, prepare for it, so... Um, it's like nukes. It's like a nuclear warfare. Well, less devastating, but still. It's like weapons you can't really do much about, <laughs> unless you have um have some of their own but anyways things are getting pretty tense obviously we'll see what Rhaenyra's is thinking probably down to go to war which is fair <laughs> it's honestly fair as a high tower fan you know it's it 
It, it is fair. And I really wish uh, uh, Allison gave Otto some more room. Because despite him being scheming and teneving, I think his stance of trying to kill them upright is probably right. And I think they're down in O2 War anyway, so getting the sneak attack in uh, might have been better. But yeah, anyways guys, thank you for watching. We'll watch the season finale of the Nets, and it should be awesome. But until then, see ya!